FEMA's Michael Strand gets scared and struggles to catch his breath after Big Shock on live TV. Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. I hope everyone is having a wonderful day. Before starting the video, please go ahead and hit the subscribe button and give this video a like up. Demez Michael Strand has struggled to catch his breath in a shocking moment on live TV The Good. Morning America star has caught fans off guard in recent episodes of the show now. Michael 51 has struggled to catch his own breath after being spooked by a co-star the TV personality promoted. Black Friday Savings steals on the morning program's Instagram page. He was joined by technology contributor Becky. Worley who was dressed as a pappy cheerleader in honor of the holiday. Michael announced her arrival, telling viewers let's bring out Becky Worley. There she is, the blonde journalist then, popped out from behind a screen as she jumped and screamed at the top of her lungs, the former athlete appeared. Shocked and frightened by her grand entrance, you kind of scared me. When you came through there, Michael admitted. Laughing with a concerned expression on his face, I'm just pumped up, she replied. Earlier this week, the football player, Stunned fans when he yelled at A-list. Guest Patty Lale during her appearance. On Good Morning America. The 50-year-old NFL star and GMA host. Playfully screeched Patty after tasting. A sweet potato pie the legendary singer had made for Thanksgiving Michael interviewed Patty 78 during a segment in Wednesday's broadcast of Good Morning America. They debated their favorite Thanksgiving dishes and cooking methods in a segment called Rapid Fire Turkey Day Questions. Patty said she prefers to make her own own cranberry sauce, while Michael admitted to enjoying the relish from the can home freaking made, Patty declared to which Michael said I mean I like them. Both but I like the canned stuff, the ridges when Michael asked if the musicy prefers peen pie or pumpkin pie, she replied sweet potato pie Michael took that as his cue to try out her dish, which was on the table in front of him. After his first bite, he yelled, Patty, that's what I like, man, this pie, right? Here is on point, the broadcaster has returned to viewer screens after more than a week spent away filming in different locations he sparked concern. After shooting terrifying scenes with polar bears in Canada earlier this month, Michael went on an expedition to see the animals during a segment on how their homes were under threat from the climate. Crisis, the clip began with a shot of the broadcaster on on a boat wearing a black beanie hat and what appeared to be a life jacket and goggles as he rode closer to the dangerous animals fans shared. Their concern for Michael at the time, with one commenting terrifying he willed, do anything just for the money shot they became even more worried when he still hadn't returned to GMA two days later TJ. Holmes A. Roback and George Stephanopoulos were all in the office during Gima's broadcast. Michael then jetted to Qatar to play a friendly game of football with military heroes at Al Uday Air Base for NFL on Fox Inside Wicked World of Skinny Scams as OAC and weight loss drive fraud. Attempts rise into the hundreds of thousands, you might like GMA guest Chris. Pine abruptly interrupts Michael. Strahan's question to make personal, revealed to host Good Morning America. Guest Chris Pine has interrupted host. Michael Strahan on live TV, the host was trying to ask him a question when he viewed it in with a personal reveal. On Wednesday, Michael, 51, Robin Roberts, and George Stephanopoulos interviewed Chris, 43, about his new movie Wish He Talked, about playing a villain singing in a movie again and more. After showing a clip of Wish, Michael went to ask Chris another question. The host put his feet up on one of the pegs of the chair, and as Michael said, we asked your co-star Ariana Davis on Monday, when she was here too, before getting cut off by the actor, I have those same socks. Dude Chris said, pointing George 62. Cracked up as Chris and Michael. Continued on talking about their matching style the socks were navy blue. 
With red, white, and blue dots on them, you know what you and I we simpatico, buddy. Michael said you and I are together then. Michael joked I have that same jacket. This caused the guest and host to crack up Michael, then went on to finish his question from before he was interrupted. This interruption came on the same day that Michael returned to GMA after. Nearly three weeks away, he was absent due to a personal family matter making his last day on the show before Wednesday, October. 26 Michael sat alongside George and Robin 62 making up the full main desk of co-hosts. At the beginning of the broadcast, Robin held up a finger and turned to Michael, can I just say we have tears of joy because Michael is back. Here she said, Michael smiled and said, it's great to be back with both of you. Thank you guys, Michael's other job, the $100,000 pyramid, also returned on. Wednesday after one week off, and this week was filled with drama he was joined. By comedians Jason Alexander, 64, and Pete. Holmes, 44, as they guest starred on the show, it was clear early on that Pete. Took the game very seriously after he admitted he lost sleep the last time he lost a match at the end of the first. Round Pete and his partner Molly were ready to play the category, can I spelunk? In your man, cave the category was things that could be found in a real cave, but should not be found in a man cave. Michael also reminded Pete and Molly that they needed a perfect score to stay in the game Pete quickly and snarkily. As does that help, Michael responded, with an equally snarky response and said, building the drama, the tension, and the drama topics, new stories on the sun. Inside wicked world of skinny scams as OAC and weight loss drug fraud attempts rise into the hundreds of thousands you might like.